The C-reactive protein, or CRP, originates in the liver from where it is distributed throughout the bloodstream. A healthy C-reactive protein level is below 10 mg. However, if this concentration exceeds this amount, it is usually indicative of inflammation in the body. Regardless of the reason for this triggered inflammation, the body will act by producing a high amount of C-reactive protein as an immune response to detecting damage. For more about the causes of a high C-reactive protein, keep watching here at On Salas Health. Severe trauma and injuries such as extensive burns can cause the body to react with this inflammatory process. Healthy muscle tissue proteins are degraded to amino acids, which will be used to produce acute phase proteins such as C-reactive proteins in order to counteract this damage. Another cause of high C-reactive proteins includes infectious diseases. When there is an external agent, the body stimulates the production of these proteins to combat any occurring damage. Some of the pathologies which can cause a high C-reactive protein include pneumonia, bronchitis, tuberculosis, septicemia, cystitis, and meningitis. Although a high concentration of C-reactive protein cannot directly indicate its origin, it can give us an idea of the probable cause. Moderate values between 10 to 100 milligrams, for example, usually corresponds to the presence of an anti-inflammatory disease, such as rheumatic fever, Crohn's disease, vasculitis, acute pancreatitis, and rheumatoid arthritis. High C-reactive protein can also be generated by cardiac disorders. In fact, levels above 10 mg could also indicate risks of cardiovascular disease. A CRP test can help when it comes to prognosis of the development of heart disorders, such as coronary syndromes, peripheral arterial disease, sudden cardiac death, and or other heart diseases. And that's it for our Unsalus Health video about C-reactive high protein. For any doubts or questions, post them into our comment section below. And if you found this video helpful, give us a like and subscribe for more. We'll see you next time.